Hey there, I'm Celia, a French freelance illustrator and full-time designer. Welcome in this new video. Today, keep me company while I'm creating a new line of cut printing. The new design that I'm going with is an old audio tape. The idea is to create a simple design that I will print on an A6 format. I'm doing a doodle of what I have in mind. Then I'm tracing the illustration to be able to duplicate it. I'm inking my lino sheet to see where I'm curving. It helps to know where I went and where I have to curve. Then I'm reporting the illustration with the tracing paper. Once it's done, I can start carving the new design. I'm starting by the long lines, trying to be consistent, and I'm also trying to take my time to not make too many mistakes, because it's quite complicated to fix once it's carved. When the design looks okay with what I have in mind, I'm cutting the extra liner on the sides, and we're almost ready to start printing it. I don't have A6 paper, so I'm cutting some A5 sheets to have the size that I need. And then I'm creating a guide where I'm marking the edges and the corners and where I'm going to fix my stamp. Once it will be done, I will be able to print several times the same design with the same margins on the paper. For this design I want to try a flashy pink so I'm mixing my magenta with a little bit of white and when the color is ready I can start printing. Even if it's a bit messy, I love this tiny design. I still have to figure out how to have cleaner prints. I know that the paint is really good, but I don't know if it's the lino which not allowing me to have a clean print. So we'll see that in my next try. Anyway, I'm quite happy with how it turned out. The result is quite cute. I'll maybe use them as thank you cards for the orders on my online shop or as little postcard, I don't know yet, so we'll see. I hope you liked this video, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week, bye!